win their second. Well, we have a very, we have a very strong panel. That's one thing that's very important. There's a lot of lads who you know, didn't get to run out today, but they pushed us hard in training, and like we played a, played a game in training last last week, like and. Jeez, the lads who didn't get to run out today, but they pushed themselves as hard. And look, you need that if you're going to get over the line. You need the whole be, panel together. You must be delighted as well. You were very efficient in the, your way in the attacking wise, especially in the first half. In this time, you kind of got off to a better start, but you got back at them in the second half, or the first half, right? Yeah, I suppose. Look, I think we just every opportunity we t- we got, we took. I think our goal, our goal lived the charm life for a long time in both halves. And look, I suppose if things had if a break of the ball had gone a different direction. It could have been in Steinman's day. So you need that bit of look and you need everything to go your way. What's it mean to you to be winning back your title from your neighbours, the Maria Ricketts? Look, it's, it's fantastic to, to, to win a championship. It's what's called it. It's always about, you know, it's, it's about, it's about our team and it's about our community and we're delighted to, to be bringing Jack Daly home to the town. Is there a sense like Bellier last week that you know, to winning a second would make you, you know, a great team, you know what I mean? Back uh, it up, like back up 2015. Look, I suppose you take every year as it comes, and it's not it's not about how people label you externally. It's about really fulfilling what you think you're able to do. And and look, we're just very happy to prove that we we can do it again. And we, we, it wasn't the ones off. And forwards in particular today, you know, that second half, you know, like Simone Cleary or Kieran Malone got some great scores. They kicked some great points, but like they are very they're very uh, talented players, but they also work very hard in it. And what you call it, look. What, what we kicked today went over the bar. I think in a diamond were weren't as lucky, and like did a few things that were looked like they were going to score goals. And look, I think we got a bit of luck as well to, to help us to help us win. You a kind of a passion speech there, you know, for the community and all the people that help out the club. I mean, it obviously means a lot uh, to the people in this town. But it, it does. But I think it means a lot to to, to to every club in the country. You know. Like the G is is the is the heartbeat of, of rural Ireland and what you call it. It's it's where it's where we get an opportunity to show our love for our parish and and, and our community is on the pitch. Um, would you like to push on now? I mean, you know, three years ago, you know, in Munster again now. Would you like to you know go that step further? I haven't thought about it. <laughs> when's, the, when's the next round? When's the Munster? Uh, you're not in um, two two weeks. Two, two weeks. Two weeks. Two weeks. Is that the whole week then? Uh, you tend to win us all. Uh, yes. The Limerick, the Limerick are the Watford. Watford is it? Well, yeah. to be honest, we haven't even thought about it, so we just concentrated on there. So look, we'll enjoy tonight, and look, we'd always watch college. Anytime you go outside the county, you want to represent your your county with, with pride as well. So look, we're going to we'll enjoy a night or two, but then we're going to get back down to work, and we we want to represent our uh, county with pride, as a lot of clubs have done before us who got out of the clear. Nice, nice, nice. Nice, good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck.